Hey mate, um, just what did you see in the fourth quarter from the guys and the way that they were able to come back? You know, um, execution, you know, on the defensive end of the floor, I thought we did a solid job. Uh, Big O did a n really nice job on Giannis, uh, just keeping him in front and not uh, allowing him to get to the rim. Uh, you know, there was a few times where he was able to uh, get to the rim. We had to send help, but for the most part, he did a solid job of being able to guard him with single coverage. Uh, and it, it allowed us to stay with those perimeter shooters. But, you know, defensively, uh, you know, that's the defense we need to play in the second half. Uh, we was able to uh, get stops. I thought offensively, I thought Trey did a really nice job of slowing down in the fourth quarter and getting what we wanted, you know, as far as our set calling and getting matchups that we wanted. And uh, we was able to, uh, you know, finish this game. I know we've talked about energy and just the urgency that that's required. What did you see in terms of, of that? Well, I think it, it first starts with believing. You know, you got to believe that you can win a game. And I think we've had some doubt uh, with all the guys being out uh, for the last really two months. And uh, you, you're, you're looking at, you know, Clint is out and, and, and Bogey is out. And we've been, uh, you know, playing this way pretty much, uh, you know, a lot this season. And, you know, sometimes you can, you can doubt uh, that you have a chance to, to win the game. And, you know, I, you know, I talked about that tonight. You got to believe, you know, you got to believe that uh, you have a chance to win. Then you have to go out there and perform. And I thought tonight uh, our guys did that. They were together. Uh, they were connected. Uh, you know, we finished with a team that we haven't finished all season long with, you know, as far as Gallo and, and Oyeka and, and Dre and Kevin. Uh, and John was very supportive of uh, his teammates being out there playing and finishing the game. That is what we need. And Yeka is obviously not the tallest guy, but, you know, since he's been in the league, he's shown an ability to stay in front of bigger, taller guys like Giannis and Embiid. Yeah. What is it about him specifically, uh, about his defensive ability to stay in front of these guys? Well, he's, he's strong. He's really strong, and he, he understands leverage. And he understands angles. Uh, you know, he does a good job of, uh, you know, getting leverage, getting underneath those guys uh, so that they're not able to just walk him or back him down. Uh, and he's very strong. You know, uh, as, you, as you mentioned, uh, he doesn't have the size, uh, you know, that length, but uh, he understands leverage. And he does a good job of keeping his body between man and basket. And, uh, you know, we've seen him being be able to defend, you know, Giannis and uh, and a guy like Embiid. Uh, but sometimes he needs some help. I thought tonight, uh, you know, he really did a solid job. Since uh, DeAndre returned from injury, what have you seen from him on both ends of the floor? You know, we, 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 he's just trying to find his rhythm, you know, find his way, uh, you know, with the group uh, that's out there. And... Uh, you know, he still hasn't had that opportunity to play with uh, really the starting group uh, with um, Bogey and, and Clint, you know, so, you know, we're, we're finding sets and, and plays, you know, actions. I shouldn't say plays because, you know, uh, we run actions for guys and uh, then they have to make plays. And uh, he done a nice job of, of uh, coming off the screen and, uh, you know, uh, making plays, getting to the rim, and he's knocking down his perimeter shot when he's behind the three-point line. We're getting the ball out to him. Uh, you know, he's allowing the game to come to him, uh, which I think is big for him. Hey, coming into tonight, y'all had lost 10 straight at home. Um, just how big was it to, to get this win at home? I know every win's important, yeah. um, but to play with this kind of energy at home and in that streak. Well, it's, I think it's very important, you know, of course, to, uh, to, to get a win. You know, I, th I think our guys, we need that confidence. We need to believe uh, that uh, and, and have something to build off of. And, you know, beating Milwaukee, uh, you know, my hope is that that give us that confidence and that belief that, uh, you know, we are we are missing some guys. But uh, if we play the game the right way, we play hard, uh, we play together, uh, we and we give ourselves a chance to win games, uh, this can happen a lot more. 
Dana came in late. I don't know if they asked you already, but as soon as you got that technical, that seemed to turn everything right around. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, it, I, I don't know if that was part of it, but it was like I, I thought they they missed a few uh, calls, and uh, um, you know, I have to go out on the floor in order to to get one of those. But uh, you know, sometimes that can that can turn a game and um you know i have to look at it i, I didn't know if it if it did it but, was like uh, 40 to 40 to 23 or something yeah. after the technical yeah so uh if if that helped us tonight uh it's worth the the, the fine I think so. All right.